Welcome back to the Zingy channel for another daily video. I've been slacking recently, but I'm getting back into the grinds of videos. So if you are new around here, hit that subscribe button, comment down below what video ideas I should do and give me feedback on this video. Right, let's try to get this video to at least 20 likes. Hit that notification bell as well, and let's get into the video. Russ. Russ, everybody's favourite rapper in the world. Uh, well, not really, because apparently every rapper hates Russ, but I personally don't. I fuck with his music heavy. Uh, always thought he was a dope artist, unique, very unique. He sort of has that sort of spin of like, sort of like a Jamaican tone, that sort of vibe. And I've always loved his energy and you know him being different as well. Like he's setting trends out here. As much of the bandwagon we can jump on the fuck Russ, like I do. I don't no not fuck Russ, but I do fuck with him. If not with that sounds weird. Oh, I, I I like Russ. All right, I love listening to his music, and it's just come out with. This new freestyle, obviously he's putting out a lot, lot of music recently, but I've got to be honest, sometimes if you put out too much music, your quality does downgrade, but people have been saying all over Twitter that this is good. It is called Grammy Bag Freestyle, so let's react. 3, 2, 1, and let's go. Yeah. Okay. It's 4 a.m. about to roll up, working on my second floor up simultaneously working on an app. I call it folding on my shoulder, trying to tone up, man, the is where my lines from. Promoted out, show me. Bro, we just came. You went straight in. Like this, this, this is a short freestyle. Only one minute, four, one minute fifty. Grammy bag freestyles. So obviously, you know, maybe he wants to win a Grammy or something. I, I didn't hear anything you said. We're gonna, we're gonna dissect this. Yeah, we're dissect, we're dissect in this bitch. However, the beat goes hard. It's on some sort of jazzy vibe wave, like some interstellar shit. Like, let's take that back, and it just goes straight in. Yeah. That's it's 4 a.m. about to roll up, working on my second blow up, simultaneously working on an app. I call it folding on my soda, trying to tone up, man. It's always where my lines from. Promoted out, Sean made a hundred and Beyonce. Oh, I like the answer. Yes, it does appear so. Couple rappers cool, but most of them are fucking weird, though. Try to Ooh, most of these rappers cool, but most of them are weird, though. You're talking about. I think that is a direct dig to people who pop Xanax, all this sort of shit, which I don't agree with at all. Never done in my life. Don't do drugs, kids. It's pretty obvious at this place now. But then again, is it obvious? Because people were just like, like Lil Pumper just saying it's acceptable to do sort of things. But he doesn't fuck with that. And that's a lot of reason why people hate Russ. And obviously the whole, you know, I produce Mix Master. But he's saying some people are weird though. Like people really be wilding. Like people be weird, man. Some of these rappers, but. Let my beer grow, made it to Malaysia. Shooting sixteens like a king of Asia. He's too cocky, he's Van Gali. Bitch, you getting blocked like my name's Ben Wally. Ice by Jane, this is not Ben Wally. Oh, this is not Ben Wally. Cheese. Is that I'm pretty sure is that a I'm sure that's ice, surely. That's a that's a watch band, right? But the flow already is there. In instantly it's there. Lyrics, I'm not some of the references I'm not getting. Maybe I'm a bit, I'm an uneducated swine, but I know he's coming with some wordplay and he's coming with that flow and energy. So let's go. That's no diss, that's a rhyme. Get off me. I feel godly. Facts. How could you blame me? Sound out the arenas, make a million in the same week. That's old. Oh, he's talking about the ego right now. I know he's talking about the ego. He didn't mention the ego, but I know he's talking about the ego. Is that how can you blame me? I'm selling, I'm making millions, selling out millions. Or oh, making millions from selling out millions, or whatever, of shows. So how can you blame me not being a little bit cocky? You know, like sometimes you do almost have to have that inner confidence that sometimes certain people can be the perspective of being, you know, you know, he's cocky, he's arrogant, he's big headed. But he's telling you how it is, man, how he really feels. He's not beating around the bush, no pun intended. Switch it up pronto. Yeah. I be out in Denver getting high with the Broncos. Oh. Listen up if you hate it, just let me say this. You probably never make it sincerely. Someone who made it. Oh. Exercise your patience, you need to master the basics. It's not my fault that you ain't got no pain. Stop that lame shit. What's funny about the game? We are stopping this right there and dissecting every word. He was reading it as if it was like a letter. You'll probably never make it sincerely. The let me just listen to what he just said. I think he was basically saying like Take it from me as someone who made it. You'll probably never make it because all your shit that you're putting out is not up to the standards. You need to go back to the basics and rehearsing. Well, hang on, let me get, let me get that bar real quick. Hate it, just let me say this. You'll probably never make it. Sincerely, someone who made it. Exercise your patience. You need to master the basics. Exercise your patience. You need to master the basics. Like exercise your patience. Work on that. If you're not getting anywhere, don't give up because I'm definitely not. I've not made it yet. In turn, well, music coming soon, which is, by the way, fire. I literally just came back from the studio the other day, uh, two days ago. But, same, you need the patience and you need to master the basics. 
No point going ahead with all the, you know, it, they, they're like, it's like making a, mu doing a song and focusing just on the music video. So it's sick. You're putting production in it, but the song doesn't hold no weight. All right. So he's saying just work on the basics, master the basics, and then you can move on. And patience is something you need. I'm, to be honest, I am an impatient person, but in life, I do realize you have to be patient. You have to wait and wait and keep on that grind, yo. And he's saying that as well, you can't. You can only blame yourself if your if your your if your shit is whack and if it's lame if you're putting that out. Like you can't say I'm not getting anywhere if you're putting out shit like that. But bro, it's not my fault that you ain't got no pain. It's not my fault. Lame shit. What's funny about the game is when they make the change shit, you're everybody's favorite till you're everybody's favorite. Fact. Y'all should really be ashamed how y'all really trying to play them. I I I'm just I'm, I've got the same mindset as Russ right now. Like. So many people have made. He's talking about the Lils here now without putting a, a, the pun. Like he's literally using Lil Wayne. I was it T Pain? I think Lil Wayne T Pain as like they are they are living legends and greats. Okay, maybe I don't understand. Some people might not agree to the extent, and even do I that they're better than like Wu Tang or Nas or any of these old school artists. But in terms of like. Our generation, especially, they've influenced every single Lil. So don't try to disrespect their name. Like they made you, bitch. <laughs> All right. So like, just listen up. Gonna be their fucking crunches because without me they'd be handicapped. So he's like the support system for his family. And I've seen, I've seen like. He did come up from Rags to Riches story, like, I feel like everyone that gets famous, but like, he really did have a tough upbringing, I know that, because I done my research on him, and I, wa I watch his stuff, like, he really be supporting his family, and he's holding that way, he's holding the crutches for his family, so fair play to you, man. Universe, pointing out desires, like, hand me that, of course I want that Grammy man. Pointing at the, wait, looking at the universe, pointing out desires, like, looking at all the stars, maybe? That could be an insinuation or a metaphor for that. Like, and he does want that Grammy bag. Maybe this is the year or next year he's gonna he's gonna get that Grammy bag. Because if I'm being honest, as even a fan of Russ, I don't think he is worthy enough. And I think even Russ fans may agree with me, or I might just get hate in the comments. But let me know if you agree or not. He's not up to the standards of the people that are getting Grammys. For example, the J Cole, Kanye West. Um, like these contenders, Kendrick Lamar, like even Logic to an extent, like, but I feel like he has so much potential. I just feel like he needs to lay off the sort of, I don't know how to say this, these sort of, it's a bit like Logic with the whole 1 800 song, these sort of commercialized, just radio tunes essentially, and focus on songs like this, because this slaps, and this is just a freestyle, and focus on a decent album. Obviously, he had Zoo and The Wolf, I can't remember The Wolf something, but. His album, when he focuses on them, they are decent, and he could potentially win a Grammy. So I believe in you, man. Oh, yeah. The kick and the drums and everything is just so calm, and a nice like ninety sort of soul singing right there. That's pretty much it. I'm gonna say from your boy and Zingy. Leave a like, leave a like on this video, leave, watch this video, link in top description, in this top of the description for this obviously official, uh, vi well, not video, audio, but, like, he's doing mad bits out here right now, Russ, he's, it, it's a good thing that he's persistent, and uh, consistently persistent, if it makes sense, I've got that quote of Dax the other day, I don't know I'm so using it, but it's true, he's, that's what he is, consistently persistent, uh, but I feel like if you work some more of these types of songs, and this is only freestyle, with a hook on these, and stuff, it's, these sort of songs can slap and be amazing. Like, What You Want, songs like them, these are songs that are rough, that are just amazing, serious, ride slow. Like, if he makes these bangers, because I've actually, if you didn't know, I've actually seen Russ live, he was amazing. You know, a lot of people complain that live he's not that great, because he literally has his hat up, but he's in his zone. Like, I, mean, he, I guess, like, people could say he doesn't put a show on, but he did put a show on because he turned up when I saw him in London anyway so thank you for watching this video if you did enjoy this leave a rating out of 10 I think I'll leave this as a as a hip hop song in this generation alright all you old heads out there don't get don't, don't get pissed all right? I know you're about to smash your TV or keyboard here I'm going to give this 
But the Kingpin's an eight. Because he talks about a lot of shit in there that people need to hear. He talks about egos, he talks about, you know, all the other people wanting Grammys and why they and people that are not making it. He talks about all sorts of shit here, providing for his family, his inner struggles and his perspectives. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this video, leave a like, subscribe to the Insane Nation, content on the way. Alright, we're one point two I wanna say one point two K subscribers now, growing stronger every single day, growing stronger with you too. Alright, so hit that subscribe button, tell your family, your friends, your plants, all you vegans out there, and, oh yeah, that notification bell, that, that's a thing, yeah, because you literally won't see my content apparently because of YouTube, so hit that notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in a bit. Now your vids hold no weight, like Titanic channel sinking to the ground, talking your piece on the web, karma always come around, eating up these W's, can't you see I have the crown, feasting on your enemies, dead and buried in the ground. Digging your own hole in the soil of what I found Your shit inconsistent, I don't really fuck around Put some respect on my name, you playing with the hounds I've been waiting, I've been saving all these bullets, all these rounds And I wonder why this hate or this hate don't come around I'm the king to the front of this shit, wearing the crown Flooding all you haters, you ain't shit, now you left to drown